On this night, I never thought that the next two weeks would be the most difficult and fun weeks that I have ever experienced. And it all starts here. Today is 20th February and just 10 days left for the university exams. A lot to study. Today was actually the last day of Origin Express series and to be completely honest, I haven't done anything regarding it since last 7 to 8 days. I am not guilty about it because the third year PSM syllabus is quite a lot and I did quite a lot of procrastination and time pass in the last few days. So from today onwards, it's going to be on vlog and I will buck up for sure. So I cleaned up my room, cleared up my desk, took out the books and started studying. Every beginning needs a spark of motivation. This year's motivation for me is set up by my roommate come senior and he always says Darte hai kya? That's what is going to be. My books are set, my motivation is on fire. So the next step is planning. My studying for PSM starts like this. For PSM 2, I have decided that I have less time, so I'm just going to do the last 10 year question papers. I take out Shetty, which is my go-to book for PSM 1. But there are few questions that I cannot find in Shetty for which I'm going to use Spark. And the combination of these three books is going to give me the ultimate notes. I'm also doing one more thing that I'm using a red pen to mark all the questions that are repeated with star. More the star that a topic has, more important it is and the more it is repeated. That way I can get a guess of the question paper that okay, this topic might be asked and this can be left for later. That way I can get a complete picture of the paper and easy study ahead. I know I'm doing this quite late but better late than never. The target that I currently have is finishing all these PSM IMPs, especially one PSM 2 which includes family planning and it takes a lot of rectification. So all the best my brain. I get myself my magic mug and start with community medicine. As I go through from chapter to chapter, I wonder Am I finishing the subject or is the subject finishing me? It isn't even two hours. My brain got tired pretty quickly. I thought, thoda ghoom ke aate hai, padhai mein man lagega. After about two hours of PSM, it's time for me to take a break and get out a little bit of riding. It's a good thing and a good change of pace and I need it right now. See ya. On the way back, I happened to get Jalebi. Like a dog salivating, my brain instantly got happy and I got back to studies. Samai kab nikal gaya pata hi nahi chala. It was evening. Hello, what's up? Good evening, friends. It's a very nice and sunny weather up in, on the terrace. I have been studying PSM from like two or three hours and we are almost done with uh, a very big chapter called health programs in India and it's all artificial and we are trying to make stories and stuff but I am tired and it's exhausting still with a little bit of break which may be a 5 to 10 minutes and I will set a timer so that I don't forget it I'll just get back and finish that chapter once and for all that will be enough for today then I'll go for ophthalmology in the face of an unending syllabus I start one page at a time even after studying all evening I couldn't even make a dent in the book. It felt as if the books are saying, Goli se nahi marega tu, padai se marega bapu. How much longer is it going to take? It is almost 7 in the evening. A padai nahi ho rahi yaar. So I gave up. I am not the type to torture myself through studies. I want to enjoy the process without worrying about the results. The evening sky, the bike rides, the fruit juice, music, everything. After coming back, I messaged my friends. Kya kar rahe ho? Hoping they will motivate me. It was a fun chat. They all seemed busy in studies. So I just left them. Then I went to trouble my roommate for the same. His words were all that I needed. Kya padhe, dada? What do you say? Plus surgery. I just padne betha aur khana a gaya. So watching the old episodes of Tarak Mehta, we had our dinner, typical Indian style. Then I just let myself relax. Dada was playing amazing drums and I was vibing through it all. After a little more studies, I decided to have a walk. After a certain summer advised me about it, I am here walking. Let's take a healthy step towards a healthy life or something I want to say. It's my first day on. Let's see how many days I can continue. It's just a good change of pace after studying so much. That's all. From the walk, 
not recommend it won't do it again maybe maybe not i studied a little more and went to sleep good morning today is 22 and it's 6 days till the end of the month so basically 6 days to revise everything from the third year now yesterday i stepped at 2 and today i woke at 8 so i need to adjust one hour of sleep somewhere 7 hours complete is compulsory i value my sleep very much the thing is that the planning that i did for the third year revisions is not working out so i think i'll make a new plan from today or tomorrow and i do need to edit one video for you guys and hopefully it will all work out today it's time to start with ophthalmology and end with csm2 but before i sit down on the fun i think i'll just go grab a little coffee i need it today morning coffee gave me enough energy to study till afternoon ये कॉफी की बुरी आदत अब और चलेगी आफ्टर कमिंग बैक एज यूजल आई क्लियर माई डेस्क सेट माई बुक्स एंड ओपन माई नोट टू स्टडी इट्स अ रूटीन दैट्स लाइक अ प्रेयर फॉर मी अ लिटिल हैबिट दैट मेक्स मी फोकस बेटर नाउ दैट आई एम कैफिनेटेड एंड रेडी इट्स टाइम टू डू दिस सो द थिंग इज दैट पी एस एम इवन इफ दे आर शॉर्ट नोट इज hard to memorize subject so what i'm going to do is i'll just remember a few words from every paragraph or every topic and then try to construct the whole short note or the whole laq around those few words because it is a little bit about understanding and some things are common like if there is a disease you need to prevent it that's common sense and that's what i'll write and hopefully it works on second thought I can do PSM later. I'll first finish off that. I just don't want to do that subject right now. I start studying for ophthalmology. Our tiny little eye is a miracle in itself. The more I study, the more complex it gets. Our vision is like magic. Lights go in and our brain perceives it. A little while later, I got distracted by the visions of the sky. I have been recording the sky on time lapse from like 2 hours and to be honest I don't see any progress in the clouds or any change in the sky at all but when I will see the time lapse later on there will be some changes some progress for sure that's just how studying is you sit on for hours and hours and you see no change because it happens so slowly and then when the exam day comes and you try and get all the answers that happiness is what i am craving for and that's why i'm going to study harder now it's for when the time lapse plays itself this time lapse feels blank doesn't it it's just like my brain but we will soon come to know it has everything i need currently i'm learning about lenses and their dislocation and what happens when the lens inside our eye gets out of the position that's what i'll be doing for a while later i will go to cataract its types and other stuff related to it what i'm doing is trying to finish one after the other chapters and all the backlog that i have so that i can start learning and revising maybe today in the evening or tomorrow i am rather fresh from the coffee in the morning and so i don't think i should sleep and yes the exam is going to be from 2 to 5 so i'm conditioning my body to be functional and highly active from 2 to 5 it's very important to notice these little things and work on them because 50% of your marks depend on what you do and what happens with you at the time of the exam wish me luck even after such an inspiring speech आखिर हूँ तो इंसान ही आई एंडेड अप स्लीपिंग इन द आफ्टरनून बट द डे इज इट ओवर इट आई वेक अप आई स्टडी अ लिटल देन आई गेट माई सेल्फ सम कोल्ड कॉफी अनादर डोज ऑफ कैफी अ कप ऑफ कॉफी एट टेन एट नाइट इज द वर्स्ट थिंग आई कैन डू टू माई बॉडी especially when i slept just 6 hours plus 2 hours in the afternoon so i think i can study a bit more cheers determined to finish today's target i sit on my desk again i end up sleeping at 2 at night there are things we all know the sky is blue the mitochondria is the powerhouse of cell too much coffee is bad for health not that i'll stop it the breakfast is already here so i very quickly brush my teeth and sit to eat pehle pet puja fir kaam dooja today is february 2023 and i'm sort of completely 
behind the schedule all my stuff so i'm going to start all the replanings today i originally decided that i should do three revisions but i think two will be enough the end of the month is in five days and i haven't posted a video in like one week or more than one week i think i'll edit one today there's residual ophthalmology and all the past stuff to do today is a busy day when the exams are going on we just can't wait for the end of exams and when the end approaches you have just nothing to do at least that's what happens in my case like the exams end and the sort of vacations start and i have nothing to do so that's why i'm planning not to stress this exam period too much but i am going to stress and enjoy the break afterwards we'll see what happens i drink i drank a very strong coffee yesterday and maybe that's the reason i couldn't sleep at night but good thing is i completed one or one more topic of of thang if i talk like this while eating i might choke on my own food so i'll just turn it off see ya then i move ahead in ophthalmology completing the backlog comes first i study about how diabetes makes us blind and how it is treated this is the most important question of the whole subject so i make sure that i give extra attention to it after it's done i plan for my day i have finally decided on the plan for today i'll first start with ophthalm and finish the rest of the part that is glaucoma something about lenses and drugs and eyelids and stuff then i will move on towards the big gun that is psm1 and try to learn at least four chapters of it by 5 o'clock all of it depends on the fact that i should not sleep today it's hard but karna padega now that i planned it all let's keep it aside you are going sideways too and off time is coming out music will help me study i won't sleep in the afternoon are kisko ullu bana raha hu main i just had a best sleep of the afternoon because exam times really make you sleepy and they do make me sleepy too i don't know what's in the air in the exam season but whatever it is it does get me very sleepy so i am lagging behind a lot and i have decided that i will skip quite a bit of ophthalm i'll do it later i just start with psm i start with screening and try to finish a few subjects of psm1 and the best way for rectification is to remember a few words of it and then try to construct the whole sort of stuff around it i'll try to remember the definitions as it is though they have quite good marks let's get working it is a fact that post sleep study session is the most productive one tick tock tick tock i was done with a lot of topics again it was time to make the same mistake coffee peene chalte hai yaar कॉफी मेक्स मी अ फिलोसॉफर समटाइम्स यू नो थोड़ा ज्ञान सुन लो आई पर्सनली बिलीव इन द फैक्ट दैट इफ यू हैव समथिंग यू नीड टू यूज इट टू इट्स अटमोस्ट पोटेंशियल लाइक आई हैव माई आई पैड एंड माई मोबाइल एंड आई एम गोइंग टू यूज इट टू द फुल पोटेंशियल बाई टेकिंग all the photos and videos and making my studies easier and helping you study as well this is the least i can do to make justice to the money i spent the same goes for your studies if you have a brain you are using your time to study doing your hard work then you should focus completely on what you are doing it just makes no sense to half ass it does it there are a few steps that i do while learning a uh, laq or any long answer questions the first choose a book and read it multiple times as you can see i have already read the topic once so it will be easier next read the headings like definition construction consumer responsibility and quality of what that way you can construct a rough blueprint of the answer in your brain and even if you forget a few lines you can just still go ahead and write the next topic the theory exams are not about perfection they are about the quantity of answers and how much you can retain afterwards i will read each and every line aloud i like reading aloud even though it troubles my seniors a little but that's a price they will have to pay to live with me i am already sorry for them and now in this definition i have underlined the keywords underlining the keywords seems like i have just underlined almost all of the definition it will make learning the definition easier i need to imagine the definition as it is now now that i have imagined it i will just try to remember it once and that is how you learn things similarly i'll go down the way and learn the whole answer that's how i learned community medicine 
it took me until midnight and now it is time to edit the video the interview between me and anuj is the most fun video i ever made good morning it's almost 8:30 not a good time to wake up but still i think this much of sleep can be managed i am stuttering words it's not a good thing i still have to make the thumbnail of the video and i do need to study psm2 i feel surprisingly motivated though for someone who has just 3 hours of sleep let's get working the secret for my motivation was anuj's exam saga episode 1 i had my breakfast watching some random stand up comedy come on life mein thoda fun bhi hona hai then i discussed some mcqs with my friends and then i studied all day and published the video it's almost 8 o'clock now thank you for such an amazing response on the video you are so so great you are so awesome thank you now i'll go and read psm 1 there's a life i wanted to live then there is this life waking up studying sleeping but just like the moon sometimes shows up in the day i thought let's do something different today so off we go first thing in the morning we hop on the bike just to get some tea why not coffee kuch alag karna tha na hello and good morning to another beautiful day i woke up a bit early rescheduling my sleep schedule so that i don't sleep in the afternoon and that got me to drink the malai wala chai from medical square and i got some breakfast and tea man. this is the sort of start of a perfect day that i never imagined that i'd have here it is we are having fun even during exam times i just hope i don't regret it in the future of course i would thing is i am very motivated to do studies today and i am so going to finish a lot of backlog but i do need some confidence in the morning so i'm going to start with the easiest subject possible and that is ent this will give me the confidence boost that i need and then i can proceed ahead see ya padho padho so i start with ent and he starts with medicine the working of the ear its deafness the membrane its perforations the surgeries the throat how sound is formed how we breathe how we swallow i studied all of it a lot of it a simple change a happier start for the day can make miracles i was done with today's target of ent even before the breakfast came it was time to take a well deserved break and watch platinum end It is an anime that shows us the existence and importance of God in a new perspective. It's afternoon already and I have finished external ear and I made some really messy notes. But if you keep it messy and keep it rough, it's just going to stick longer inside the brain. Or that's what I think. It's just faster and more fun this way. I will now take a break and then get back to ENT again. These are the last four crucial days of preparation and I cannot slack off even for a minute. We haven't received our hall ticket yet. Hall ticket has a little bit of stress and that stress makes us study more. So I am just hoping our hall ticket comes soon. Times like this, keeping a positive outlook is the best way to cope up with the situation we cannot handle. If something bad happens, your future self will be able to handle it. but your current self should have fun and work hard again i spent the rest of the day studying that's the power of starting with a positive attitude on a side note my posture is very bad please sit straight it is very essential for your back good morning today is 26 february and including today just three days are left for the end of february and then two more days for your state exams Now I am left with yesterday's backlog of ENT, and I need to do off time today. So I am going to use the Pomodoro 30 minutes technique to finish both of them. It's time I get kind of a lot, lot serious than I should have. The closer you get to the exams, the more and more you can study. That's just how stress works in my brain, at least. So my routine started again: cleaning the messy room, getting out, getting some coffee. looking around here and there and coming back but to my surprise a melon was waiting for me 
Little surprises like these really make my day. As you know, motivation can be of two types: a positive one and a negative one. In a negative motivation, you force yourself in some kind of revenge against the subject, or maybe Sharma ji ke ladke se better marks laane or something like that. And that is not fun. That is sort of like self torture, which is very bad. In positive motivation, you try and enjoy whatever you are doing. Even if it is a boring subject, you just try making stories or having fun in some way or the other. I personally like to treat myself after finishing every subject or something like that. So choose your motivation and work with it. Just like that, I get back to the backlog again. Finishing the rest of the year, I move on to community medicine. My past self left me a sticker there to cheer me up and it worked. I got cheered up. I used Park the 2000 pages book to read a few topics and then Shetty to read a few more topics. Another mistake that I will regret later. I have spent half of my day doing ENT of time PSM alternating the subjects. Sort of I haven't done much in anything but still it is progress. things about think about this theory exams is your smartness isn't the factor the factor to score it is to predict the exam itself the more questions you predict and the more questions you revise is the more marks you get suppose the topper just skips topic like a return of last man that comes in the exam because of his bad luck then him is messed up but on the other hand if an average student just learns only the things that are important like only the three lq that will be asked for three days he is so going to talk that's the difference so study smart so i opened the previous year questions and started learning the most frequently asked ones it was evening in no time and i got out for a walk as usual the day was over i was almost done with half of third year revision here's to the end of one more day in which i couldn't complete the target that i wanted to from here on two days left and three subjects four subjects left for like psm 1 and 2 luckily it's about 6 o'clock and i have four hours more let's not get disheartened the game is still on just so you know i am following the news about war closely but like like the most of you i cannot do anything about it All I can do is pray for the safety of the people there and study hard for my university exams. नींद के पीछे मत भागो, पढ़ाई के पीछे भागो. नींद तो वैसे ही आ जाएगी. Good morning. Today is going to be a great day. It starts with bike rides and tea again. Time to start another day with an intention to finally finish all reading. It's a good day outside. A little windy and quite a lot sunny. I am going to start with facial nerve and then go down to pharynx, larynx, trachea and then behind to esophagus. Reading that, and then I'll go to the eye of thermology. And lastly, I'll try and solve the community by community medicine. It's all sounding so easy while talking to the camera, but when I actually sit and do it, I get exhausted in like half an hour or so. Well, that's the part about movies and series. they just don't show the hard work it's the real deal and that's why many of us fail as long as i don't give up i won't fail is baar dimag ne mera saath nahi diya is one of the day which is very bad for studies i am procrastinating for like 2 3 hours now it's almost 1 o'clock and i still haven't opened the books so i'll take a stroll out and maybe that will bring my motivation back i got myself the best way to cheer up and study it worked like a charm जरा से लालच से दिमाग के घोड़े दौड़ने लगे आई एंडेड अप स्लीपिंग इन द आफ्टरनून बट ऑल इन ऑल इट वॉज अ वेरी प्रोडक्टिव डे आई डिड नॉट फील लाइक इट दो देर वॉज सो मच मोर लेफ्ट टू स्टडी दैट आई फेल्ट रियली लॉस्ट दे सो मच ऑफ लर्निंग लेफ्ट एंड इट्स ऑलमोस्ट टेन ओ क्लॉक कांट वी स्कीप टू द गुड पार्ट नो वेल एक्चुअली वी कैन स्कीप टू द गुड पार्ट with the power of music a nice 10 minute therapy with my favorite playlist got me back to life i ended up staying up late that night again here comes the last day of the month exams are closer than ever my study time is increasing too and so is my anxiety being a student in times like these is 
very terrible because our coping mechanisms get exhausted one after the another. As you know, the war is still going on, and of course, it doesn't concern us in any way, but it still feels bad as a human, right? And just after recovering from a pandemic with millions of deaths, and yes, I'm going to say it again and again in every video because it does matter that much. And going inside the war, I wonder if God really hates humans or something. Well, in any case, I so hope that I don't live in another historical event for like 10 more years. I want a boring life or something. For now, it's time to go harder into studies, maybe after a coffee. I got out to get the stationery for the exams. A Trimax pen, some refills, a scale and a diary. When I went for shopping for the stationeries and I got myself this. It's a little thing that I am trying to do to avoid my anxiety. Just when my studies were going more focused than ever before, the college called for hall ticket. Currently in college for hall ticket and well that will cause a lot of time pass so <sighs> anyways I am going to enjoy meeting my friends that's all. Exam going preparation. Slow and steady wins the race. Yay! So far, we have submitted the hall ticket after taking the photo and signing it up. Now we will wait for it to come back. That is another hour of the day we start tomorrow. Update on things after going to the college and coming back, I went to sleep. It's 6 o'clock and now I woke up and I'm going to fill my stomach with something and then again going to study. I hate how many times I repeat it. The doors we open and close each day decide the lives we live. For this whole week, I opened the door of studies. Even if it is tiring, I have to do it. There is no other way. It's going to be alright in the end. It's a common notion that we set targets to motivate ourselves and then we just miss the target and lose all the motivation. Even if you lose the target or miss it, there's always another day. Keep at it. And that's what I'm doing. It's one at night and I am going to try and finish this PSL. It's do or die now. So all the best to me. Today is 1 March and we are finally here to the day of no return. Or so what I call it. Whatever I do today will decide how my exams are going to be like. My first exam paper is PSM1 which is on 3rd and so I am planning to start PSM1 from today but the thing is a lot of PSM2 and a lot of off semester is also left and I am a little sleep deprived. I think I'll get some coffee, charge up my brain and start with studies. I am planning to break the habit of coffee after exams on 10 March or something but until then that's my savior. It is 1 March and same thing goes on and on in the video. It may feel like I am boasting too much about studies but that's what we medicals do during the exam times. The intention of this video is to show you how my exam time goes by. I procrastinate a lot, I time pass a lot, I make a lot of mistakes and I fail a lot. I try to get back up, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. That's how life goes by, that's how my preparation goes by. If this video made your life easier, if this video made you smile, even for a little bit, let me know in the comment section and consider subscribing me. Also, share this video with your friends. It means a lot when our family grows bigger and bigger every single day. It's 3rd March, the exam day is finally here. Catch me in the next video to see if my studies worked out. Spoiler alert, it's going to be fun. This is Abhijit signing off. Happy studying!